Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. So, I'm like really excited for this video because I finally got my hands on the Tati Beauty Palette. It's dirty right now, okay? I've used it, but I used it for the video and I got messy. But, dude, I've wanted this palette since like the day she announced she was coming out with it. I was like, I need it because it literally has all the colors that I love, but also like you could just do so much with it. And I was like, I need this palette. Like looking at the swatches and stuff, I was like, like I need this palette in my life. But I couldn't get my hands on it because it sold out really fast. And so then she restocked it finally like a few days ago. And I finally was able to get it. And I'm like so happy. I wanted this palette for so long. I just can't believe I still have it. Anyway, um, you've probably already seen how it looks, but I still just wanted to include the swatches here so you can see the swatches because I was so excited to swatch this. You've probably already seen swatches later, but I just had to include it in here. <laughs> This palette's already really dirty. Like that's the only thing about it. Like it, um, it's like matte, and it gets dirty really easily. So that's the only downside of that. There's like already a bunch of fingerprints and like grease on it. So it's not good. But I literally love it. Um, yeah. So we got six shades, Memory, Ritual, Story, Soothe, Aura, and Poet. And they are in four different finishes. Matte, Sequin, Metallic, and Glitter. So yes. And it has this huge mirror, which is amazing. I did this eye look, the palette, and I am so happy with it. I really like the eye look. I think it's really pretty. Anyway, enough of that. We're gonna get into the video. It's going to be a voiceover because it just makes it a lot easier for me. So yeah, I hope you enjoyed. Okay, to start off with my transition shade, I am going to be using the shade Soothe Matte in my crease, and I'm just blending that out. Then I am going to be using the shade Ritual Matte in my crease as well. Well, I'm putting it on my outer corner and also in my crease and just make, making sure to blend that. Um, I'm just adding the shade to add more depth to my crease. And since I'm doing a half cut crease, I just want to add the shade to the outer corner. Now I'm gonna do my half cut crease. I'm using my Tarte Shape Tape Concealer to cut my crease. Now on my eyelid, I'm going to be putting the shade Story Metallic all over my eyelid. So this is how it looks so far, I really like it. And then now here I'm just like making sure to blend everything so it, there's no harsh lines. This is where the fun part comes in, the glitter. I am so in love with this with these glitters. So first here I'm just adding the glitter Soothe and I'm just putting that on like the edge of where the shade Soothe metallic ends. And then on top of Story Metallic, I'm adding uh, Story Glitter, but just like a dust of it, not a lot. So that is how the glitter looks. I love it. Now I'm going in with my cellar water and a Q-tip and just cleaning the edges up. And then for eyeliner, I'm using my Physicians Formula Eye Booster Eyeliner. I really love this eyeliner. It makes it easy to do a wing liner. 
After a really long time, I finally got the wings to look decently even. I'm gonna do my base makeup, but I'm not gonna, I'm gonna speed it up and not like explain it because that's not what the video is about. The video is about Tati Beauty, so. Now to highlight my brow bone, I'm using I'm using the shade Aura Matte and putting that on my brow bone and making sure to blend it out. And then for my inner corner, I'm using Aura Metallic. Now for my bottom lash line, I had first gone in with Story Matte, but then I changed my mind and went in with Poet Sequin instead because I liked it better. Before going with eyelashes and mascara, I am using my Catrice Dewy Glow Setting Spray and then I'm using these lashes by Kiss in the style Teddy. Now for lips, I'm using this Revlon lipstick in the shade Bare Affair. Just popping this right on no lip liner. Then I'm going in with the ColourPop So Juicy Plumping Lip Gloss in the shade Viceroy and we are done. 